You know, I, I just wanted to mention that um, I schedule everything every day. <laughs> I will have a secretary, yes. And um, I was wanting to start a new business called Velda's Private and Guest Investigation Firm. Yeah. <laughs> um, where a lot of the employees that work with Marilyn, I wanted her to manage that. Yes. Uh, they will be going over the actual evidence of any crime of any oath of office that was vested with, yes, the power to support and defend the laws of their individual states, yes, support and defend the constitution of their individual states, yes, and then support and defend the actual constitution of the United States, excuse me. Mm -hmm. Now, this power that is vested in you, yes, mm -hmm. You haven't been using it. And I think if you don't use the vested power of the oath of office, mm -hmm. you lose it. Now, um, this idea of impeachment, modifying or revoking the vested power of the oath of office. Yes, I have uh, given you the evidence of quite a few different crimes. Yes. And you decided to misprison all of these felonies because... You said you don't have to enforce the laws of the United States. <laughs> now, if you look at the definition of treason, <laughs> not using the vested power of your oath of office is treason. <clears throat> now, I wanted to get you for treason today. And I wanted my sons and I wanted to speak to Marilyn. <laughs> Now, just so that you, you know, there's seven days in a week and I schedule everything that I do. Yes. But I don't decide to do everything scheduled until I wake up on the day of the scheduled uh, things that I'm going to do. <laughs> because quite often I'll just change my mind about what I want to do. Poop! And for a lot of you that are scheduled for whatever that you're supposed to do that day, <laughs> it will be a very frustrating experience finding out that I decided to change the schedule because I'm in control of my life. Yes. Even though we've scheduled everything we're going to do, <laughs> I never have to do what is scheduled. <laughs> now, this will be very frustrating to a lot of employees and volunteers of the office <laughs> when I decide that I like to stay in bed and talk to a beautiful naked woman <laughs> about what questions I have that I don't have the answers to. <laughs> yes, she does. Yes, she does. Because these fallopian tubes are important to me. Yes, they are. <laughs> The cooperation of the nation is important to me. Yes, it is. <laughs> and then there's this whole idea of reproduction and conceiving babies and my involvement in various businesses that sometimes it's better for me to just go back to bed and talk with a beautiful, naked woman about what's really important to me. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>